Hi, Nick Perdomo here. One of the things I'd like to talk about a little bit is also about cigar etiquette. And one of the biggest things that I see also that people make mistakes on is the actual cigar ban. The cigar ban, of course, was put on to protect people's fingers. Today it's used, of course, for branding and letting you know what cigar you talk about or what you like to smoke or, and so on. A lot of people I see will take a cigar, light it up, and pull this cigar band off. What happens is if you pull the cigar band off, this wrapper is very thin. It's almost like an, the skin of an onion. It's really that thin. So when you pull that band off, it has a fruit pectin that holds this band together. When you pull the band off, what happens is you produce multiple fine stress cracks along the wrapper. When you're smoking it with the heat, the wrapper expands, hence you start getting explosions on your cigars. People will say, why did my cigar crack? Well, you took the band off. In reality, what you want to do is you want to smoke this cigar to about a quarter of an inch from the band. Now the barrel is heated, the glue now is moistened because of the heat, and now you can safely take your cigar band if you wish to take it off. Plus, I like you guys keeping the cigar band on. I like people saying they smoke a Perdomo cigar once in a while. So try not to keep that, try to keep that cigar band off till you're about a quarter inch off and you'll see that you won't have any breakage on your wrapper and you'll be able to enjoy your product a lot better. If you liked this tip, there's plenty more where that came from. Go to CigarAdvisor.com and click or tap on the Articles tab at the bottom of the page. Expand the Show Topics sidebar. Then click or tap Cigars 101 to read tips, tricks, and advice from all the contributors to Cigar Advisor magazine.